flip and accumulate. Hey guys, as you can see, I'm here with Salima. I probably should keep my mouth shut, but. <laughs> um, and she is going to be doing what, Salima, today? I am going to be doing a lactic peel for you mm -hmm. to try and uh, fight a little bit of the dryness of the skin and do a laser and blue light treatment. Awesome. To fight the acne bacteria within the skin. And this is, it's not abrasive, right? Like it's not? None of it is abrasive. As a matter of fact, the lactic peel is one of the gentlest thing you can actually get it done in clinic. Mm -hmm. It is so hydrating, it literally just changes everything. So your skin can be flaky and dry, and as soon as you get the lactic peel done, it feels super hydrated. As soon as you apply your moisturizer, it soaks right into your skin. It's awesome. just amazing. So someone is asking, mm -hmm. oh by the way guys, you can ask your questions if you have any questions for Salima and I will read them out and she will answer them. So the first question is, is she in Toronto or Ottawa? Uh, Toronto. Yeah, and I am in her uh, like home clinic, but do you also work from outside? Not currently, Not because we're trying to cut down that hour as well, where, where I'm just too busy with the uh, skincare clinic that um, I had launched a year ago, Salima mm -hmm. Skin Solution. Mm -hmm. So my hours are limited in terms of doing treatments. That makes sense. Yeah, you guys, if you want to check out her line, make sure you do. I tagged it in my previous post um, on, on my Instagram story, so you can check it out. So this is what the cleanser that I just use right now mm -hmm. is what you use on a daily basis, mm -hmm. the purifying cleanser. Right. So we're just prepping the skin as we're going to now proceed with the exfoliating part. Okay. So someone is asking, how do you get rid uh, or reduce under eye circles? Under eye circle, it's very important to have a good eye clean. Mm -hmm. When removing your makeup, be extremely gentle, like super gentle, especially if you wear eye makeup on a daily basis. Mm -hmm. And another thing you can do is, aside from a good eye clean, I suggest using green tea bag mm -hmm. twice a week. Place it on each eye, dip it in hot water first for about a minute and then leave it on the on the eye, just like that, mm -hmm. for 15 minutes. And it helps with the circulation, and it helps, and the bridge nose right here, mm -hmm. if you press it, it just helps release all that tension, oh, really? and sends more oxygen. Yeah, it's just because there isn't enough blood circulation right. happening in that area. Right. So the caffeine from the green tea is excellent for that. And now someone is asking, which of your products would you recommend for really bad acne scars or pigmentation? So is it just the pigmentation and the scars, or do you have active acne as well? That's important. Okay, to so, if, so who is this asking? Oh, let me scroll. Okay, always so. sh shave, always what? Oh, always have, always will. Answer uh, Selena's question about, what was it? Pigmentation? Pigmentation. Okay. Yeah. So if you have active acne right mm -hmm. now, you should be actually using the oily active um, oily acne kit. Mm -hmm. And if you have scars in addition to that, then you can use the brightening retinol and vitamin C. So that will help get rid of all that scar and inflammation post from post acne. But if it's just you know over the years you haven't had any active acne and you want to just get rid of the um, the scarring, then I suggest using. You should always be using a skincare system, and in this case, you'd be using the hyperpigmented kit mm -hmm. system plus the uh, brightening retinol that should address the uh, scarring issue. So you just exfoliate your skin, and I'm just removing it now. And which which exfoliant? So it, this is from your line, right? Yes, it is from the line as well. Okay. The derma exfoliant. Obviously, these are the fifteen size. What's on here? Okay. That's the bigger size, but it comes in a in a in a in a little tub sort of thing, right? Yeah, right here. Yeah. Perfect. <laughs> Yusuf is like, what is happening? Where is lunch? <laughs> <laughs> lunch is coming after a glow skin, glowing skin. <laughs> Hi, man. My sister says hello. Hi. Oh, and by the way, Salima, I know you were complaining about your scarf, but literally, like, a lot of people are complimenting it. Really? Yeah. Oh my god, I look like I'm going to a funeral with the greens because I don't <laughs> do colors. 
Oh, so someone is asking, can we book an appointment if I wanted to for Mother's Day coming up? Definitely. Sure. You can share my number so okay. they can call me and okay. um, we can book an appointment. Or they can always go and to Insta on my Instagram and that's what send I, me a DM. I suggest you guys do that if that's okay with you, Salima. Yes, please. Okay, so if you're interested in booking an appointment, then make sure, um, and actually Mother's Day is perfect uh, if you want to take your mom or if you're a mom and you want to treat yourself, then you can um, go on to Salima's um, Instagram. As I said, I left it in my previous post on Instagram story and you can find more information about her and also you can DM her if you'd like to book an appointment. Okay, somebody said, if you have skin problems, you are highly likely lacking in vitamin C and zinc. Is that true? You could be lacking one of the two or a lot more than that. So bad skin does not stem only for that. So there's a few other issues that you should look into as well. Mm -hmm. So what kind of problematic skin are you faced with? If it's acne, there's a lot more than you need in zinc and vitamin C, such as the um, fish oil and the evening primrose, which I talk about a lot. Mm -hmm. And you can also visit our website and the blog. We have all of the tips that we share with all our customers. Um, you should be taking supplements, definitely, but you should also take care of your insides by trying to detoxify. Incorporating apple cider is not only for acne-prone skin. I find that the skin just is better able to, by removing all the toxins and having a healthy bacteria, a healthy gut, a gut bacteria in the system, helps your skin with your hair, with overall your health. So incorporating things like that, lemon water, these are the things that one should invest in because it's always what you put in, not only what you put on the top of it. So um, there's another question here. It says, do you recommend hydrofacial or for acne scarring? Hydrofacial? Mm -hmm. So any type of facial, if it's scarring, it won't really do much. I recommend doing a little bit, you're going to need something that's a little bit more abrasive to try and get to the deeper level of the five layers of the skin. Mm -hmm. So glycolic peels in combination with micro peel or even laser, that should help. But 60% is what you do at home. So you do need something with active ingredients so that's medical grade, that you're using it on a daily basis as well as weekly, such as the exfoliant that we have. And the mask, that's like a weekly, twice a week. And then the cleanser and the toner, those have salicylic, is active ingredients that are continuously shedding the skin, which helps to slough off all that dead cells. So that way the fresh skin comes to the surface and slowly but surely all that scarring just diminishes just with time. Okay, so now we're ready for the peel. I just prepped your skin. You guys are seeing my background. It's really <laughs> crazy. Um, Someone said, Salam beautiful lady, Salima skincare products are a game changer. I totally oh. agree with you. Thank you so much, honestly. Really appreciate your feedback. It's, it's everything. That's a game changer. This is the reason why I get up every day and I do what I do and with a smile. And she's so passionate, you guys. She loves doing what she does. Um, and she's like the person behind it all. So, you, you know, when it's when it's a small business like this and you have somebody who's running it who's passionate, you know it's going to be a good product. You know, it is important. It was a very imperative to me from day one that we didn't just sell any product, that we coached people through before purchasing, how to use it, if they're having any concerns, how to go through the different stages while your skin is purging, especially for those who are acne prone. You feel the tingling, by the way. I, I do. my the lactic okay. peel, but it's the mildest form. It is so amazing. Yeah. The lactic peel, by the way, is actually amazing even for people who have eczema. This most sensitive skin type can tolerate lactic. Yeah. Actually, yeah, it's not helps open up all those pores. Yeah. And I, you feel the tingling in certain spots, which I'm assuming is where most of the bacteria is, or what? Just certain parts of your skin, yeah. because not every pore is, is the same, mm -hmm. so you'll feel it a little bit more. doesn't mean it's working necessarily more, mm -hmm. but those are the areas that you'll be tending to be more sensitive, like the nose area, for example, right, mm -hmm. on the cheeks. Yeah. But other than that, it's working evenly okay. and shedding all that dead cell. So all the dull skin just sheds off, and the, the, the game starts from now, three days from now all that dead cell continues to shed. Nothing that you can see physically, like sheets peeling off, mm -hmm. but it's that gentleness that it just eats away all that dead skin cells that's just on top that would have normally taken 28 to 30 days to come off. 
it will come off and then you will notice the resilience in your skin. Awesome. Um, so someone is asked, well not someone, my cousin is asking where can you buy the products? You can purchase the products on Salima's website. So if you go to Salima's Instagram, you'll have, the link is in your bio, right? Yes, it okay, is. The link yes. will be in her bio and you can purchase that. Also, um, is my code still uh, active? Yes. Okay. Is. My code is NOOR20. So if you'd like 20% off your purchase, you can use that um, for a limited time. And yes, limited, limited time yeah. because we're getting rid of those codes. <laughs> so make sure you get your products in before the code um, before the code is removed. Um, second question. And I always suggest try, the code does not work with the travel kit. Okay. Try the travel kit size because that's what I try to put together. It's the entire line in, in a smaller package that lasts you about five weeks, which gives you the gist of the entire system without having to invest in the kit. So this way you're confident. We don't want anyone purchasing something, they're not happy with it. If you have a reaction, which is like 1% of our total customers to date, you call us right away. We want to understand what's going on. If you're having a reaction, it happens within 48 hours. We're here to exchange it. So invest in the travel kit size. Go from there. And obviously, you can buy the other things, such as the vitamin C and the brightening retinol. Those two, unfortunately, just come in the one size. But once you start with the travel kit, which comes with the six products, the main basically products that you need, which is the cleanser, toner, moisturizer, sunblock, mask, and exfoliant, that should give you a proper just of what the whole system is all about. Someone is asking, what would you do for little bumps on your face that aren't, that, that isn't acne? Exfoliating. Exfoliating. Definitely. That is dead skin congested. Yeah. That's trapped into the skin. That is not having any way of releasing it. So it's just sitting there creating all that unnecessary texture. So you need to exfoliate gently, I always emphasize, but effectively consistently and you will see it opens up and it all comes out and that's really what I love about your cleanser I mean your uh, your uh, exfoliant is that it's not harsh like the little beads are small enough to not cause damage and that's which a lot of other ones do yeah you know why because the skin is like silk so we need to treat it with gentleness we don't need abrasiveness so it throws me off whenever I see people using brushes mm -hmm. and all these spinning unnecessary things as the skin it has its own immune system it does everything naturally so all we need to do is use few things to help come off naturally what would have happened anyway without being abrasive because now that you're young you might not notice the damage that you're causing the skin if you continue on that path, your skin will lose its elasticity. It's everything. So you need to preserve and do things modestly. <coughs> okay, so it's going to burn a little bit just because now we're balancing the pH level mm -hmm. and neutralizing, removing all that. Mm -hmm. Oh, I feel that. You feel it? Mm -hmm. it, sh it just within a second, it cools off. Though. Yeah. Okay, so somebody said, how to get freckles? Get rid of freckles? <coughs> I don't know if they mean how to get rid of freckles or how to get them. Well, I don't give you freckles, that's for sure. And I don't know if I would recommend getting rid of it. It's just a beautiful thing. Mm -hmm. Like, it's natural. Some girls I see in their beauty routine, they try adding right? freckles. Nah, I would not try and get rid of it. We can <coughs> we have treatments. We have microneedling. We have microdermabrasion. We have different treatments, but no, I would not do that. Uh, what else do we have? Okay, how does your entire skin feel? Much any, cooler now. No. Any itchiness? No. Any tingling? No. Nothing. Okay. We're just gonna let this absorb you. Talk to them. I'm just gonna turn on the laser, so okay. you're gonna hear a loud noise in the okay. background. Okay. How long does that loud noise last? Dur the just duration. The tra yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah so we're gonna do laser now. Um, you guys will see, but you're not gonna be able to hear much of me talking, I guess, because it's a loud sound. But anyways, just reading through your comments here. And guys, remember, it's what you do every day that matters. Like, you go to the gym, you take care of your health, you eat healthy, that pays off. So don't look for the miracle treatment because there isn't such. And I tell everybody, I do not have a miracle treatment for you. I honestly don't. You take care of your skin, you take care of your health, your body, it pays off. So eating things, treating things from within is key. And having a persistent routine is, is, is a priority. And make sure you're using everything from the same line. I don't think 
been really been using cleanser from one company and toner from another or thinking toner is not useful it really doesn't give you the best skin possible that you are entitled to that you could possibly have because different ingredients react differently when you give the skin or the company that you're the brand you're investing in a good chance to use their entire system properly then you can rule out what is it doing for your skin and maximize its benefit because you cut short this is your skin it's your face invest in it we invest in unnecessary things that go out of style it could be watch it could be bags <coughs> for me this is passport so maintain it right yeah somebody says do you offer this treatment abroad abroad yeah like would you travel to if they pay for my ticket <laughs> and they want to bring it <laughs> you guys if you want to do it come over just buy her a ticket and buy her over <laughs> She'll gladly break our kit. No, but we are planning a tour, inshallah, mm -hmm. we don't know exactly what happens to be the country or the city this person is in, yeah. but we are planning. Okay. Did you hear that? <coughs> oh, someone is asking about a diamond peel for acne scars. Diamond peel that I think they're talking about the micro okay. there is okay. It's a diamond encrusted micro -demibration. That you're going to need a series of treatments. Again, you have to make sure you don't have any active acne. You, you do, you got to help spread that bacteria. If you don't, and it's been, you know, basically under control for a while, then you can go ahead and do make sure it's just a qualified person doing it for you, and that you do have also a good skincare treatment to follow through with it. Because really, any treatment you do <coughs> is nothing unless you have a good routine at home. To continue, like if right now Noor was to do this treatment, she was to go home and use her black soap bar. I'll tell her just save me time and money. Go I'm home. Dope, yeah. <laughs> go home. You're lucky. I love your products. I don't use anything else. Um, My product loves your back. Okay, but did you see what he does to your skin? <coughs> Someone said I recommend everyone to cleanse their colon because the colon is the main organ which is linked to the skin. Yes, and but that you have to do it with the consultation of a physician, because yeah. not every skin, every uh, person can handle it. Right. It is very sensitive sometimes that you have ulcers and you don't know what it can do to you. So you make sure you talk to your doctor before you book your appointment, because now they're promoting it as a diet. But you can literally just take off the side of it like a shot, we water one teaspoon, fifteen minutes prior to your meal and really have healthy gut and probiotics. Invest in good <coughs> supplements, probiotics, fish oil, evening primals, zinc, and vitamin C should be your go-to. If you're taking a um, one-day supplement, in addition you can, but make sure you speak to the, whoever you're purchasing it from to guide you through as to the quantity of what you should be taking. So you gotta wear this, okay? Oh, I'm gonna look so dumb. <laughs> okay, I can't see you guys, sorry. Position. Just a little bit. Is that okay? Or is it too tight? <laughs> it's popping my eyeballs up. <laughs> because of the <this. laughs> Because of the bottom. Guys, honestly, if anyone takes a screenshot, I'm blocking you. <laughs> <laughs> like you can see right now, right? <laughs> Yusuf, do the management. Yusuf needs to manage what's going on now. Oh, also, all the guys that are commenting stupid stuff, Yusuf, you need to take care of what are they saying? They're like haram sister. Like, what am I doing? I'm what is haram? So I don't have makeup on. Like, we're not changing anything. <laughs> we're changing skin. So, Let's Lima, you can see. Is it is it is it showing you and me together? Yes. Okay. Wow. Nice glasses. Very and I right. <laughs> don't hate. So we'll take Yazi's question. So what would you recommend to use if you have dry and sensitive skin but want to glow to your skin at the same time? So use the sensitive skin care line if you're talking about from my line but if you're not and you just make sure that you're using a good exfoliant that is gentle enough and make sure that you have a mask to follow through with it and you have to get a super hydrating moisturizer. Alright, how would I go about using a lactic acid? 
you can't do that by yourself. You have to go into a clinic and get it done. I don't recommend anything <coughs> so, and I cannot advise you because it doesn't matter how gentle it is, you can burn your skin. Um, someone's asking how to remove tan and lighten skin tone. How to remove tan. If your skin is tan naturally, that's the amount of melanin you have in your skin, you can. You're just going to have to weigh it out. And don't use any bleaching agent, guys. Honestly. <laughs> Their skin because I've seen product. The more fair they are, the prettier they are. Sad, but true. Armor says, uh, "Love the scar." Armor <laughs> says, "Love the scar." The scar? Yeah. Well, you know what? Now I feel really good. <laughs> yeah, Armor, thank you. It's my nephew, by the way. Um, when you say that acne is incurable, what do you mean by that? Acne is a skin condition, just like diabetes. It is <coughs> incurable. You can grow out of it. It is hormonal triggered, environment, and many other factors, just food sensitivity. So you're going to have to, the only way to control it is with a good regimen and supplements and making sure that you have a healthy habit. And similarly with those who have diabetes, they can't rely on medication and think they can cure their diabetes. If they don't eat properly, they can't, they can't manage it. Um, Molly XOXO says, you're so humble, mashallah. Oh, thank you so much for that. I appreciate it. Um, what is the best to use for acne scars? Okay, so best is something active. You need an active ingredient such as the brightening retinol <coughs> or the vitamin C. Is that what you're asking? Hmm? Yeah, you need something with active ingredients, okay? My daughter is really impressed with my glasses, but okay, it's time to come off your glasses and you can take them off too more. Good this thing? Yes. Um, any suggestions for facial hair removal after no success with laser hair removal? Okay, so if the laser hair removal was done correctly with the uh, right technology, you shouldn't have had any issues unless you have a hormonal problem. But aside from laser, I just recommend threading. I don't like waxing or epilators. So, but I'm surprised you didn't see results because you should have. Alright, how can one reduce hyperpigmentation due to acne? Are we talking about what products to buy? Because you need to protect your skin. You need some block. Number one, that's the only way you can prevent scars from, for anything from scarring, skin from to heal properly. The quality based skincare. Which laser treatment is good for <coughs> large pores and double toned skin with acne scars? Photo rejuvenation. And how is Spectra Laser for smooth and flawless skin? Pardon? How is Spectra Laser? Spectra Laser. Never even heard of it. Um, what treatment to remove milia? I have milia under my eyes. That you need a brightening retinol for. You need something with the retinol A because it is stubborn and it's stuck. What's milia? It's, a, it's like a white head, but it's a little oh. bit more prominent. It's, you can see it injury. People get out on the eye. It's not a star? No. 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 So look up. I'm just going to moisturize it. What about the dark hyperpigmentation that most Asians have around the mouth? That's melasma. If it's around the mouth and it's consistent and it's uniform, that's melasma. And you need something like the AHA and the vitamin C in, in order to reduce that. But to completely get rid of, sometimes it can be hard because, like I said, melasma is hormonal triggered. Usually women get it. It's like a pregnancy mask. But if that happened, and sometimes people get it due to bad waxing experience or laser treatment, hair removal, that is. So if you consistently exfoliate, because it's always that dead layer at the top that continuously, if you shed it off, then the lighter or the fresher skin comes to the surface. And using active ingredients such as the retinol or vitamin C to brighten or lighten the scar. Um, why don't you list your full ingredient list of your products on your website? Is this something you are looking to change? Is it a bit of a chore to email and inquire? No, I'm not planning to change because it's a lot of ingredients. All of the ingredient list is on the bottles. It's just the way we choose it. And we know it's hypoallergenic and there isn't anything that is geared towards being allergic to anybody. So if you have a specific question about one product, we can definitely assist you and you know email you what ingredients it is in that particular product. But it's a lot for us to go through that. Um, what lactic peel machine is best for great results or are they all the same? There is no machine. Lactic peel, it is actually a chemical peel. So it comes in a liquid form, such as this, it's concentrated, it's from sour milk. 
There's glycolic, which is, which is sugar cane derivative. This Sour is, milk? Yeah. <laughs> Interesting, right? The acidity from the milk. See how ancient time we taught, we've learned something and we're just modifying it now. Do you mind if we jump back to these questions? Yes. And then go back? Okay. Thank you. So we have, um, how long do the products last? I find that so, more on the upper side of my budget. So the bigger size kit, this guys lasts you <coughs> five to six months. This is your regular size moisturizer, and this is the size of the cleanser and the toner. The mask and exfoliant lasts you about seven to eight months. Like literally, and Noor can tell you that. Yep. You need a little bit. See this? This is the exfoliant and what it looks like. A little bit is all you need, and it goes a long way. So the grits, you can feel it. You're just helping it spread. For example, when it's exfoliant and the mask, you just need a thin layer. So people might think it is expensive, but if it works for you, do you rather go and spend different products and, and just let it sit in your shelf or just spend? Because this is medical grade. There's a lot that goes into it. We don't just come up with the price. Unfortunately, that's, that's, the, that's the reality of spending in, in a quality-based skincare. So it does last you five to six months, and a little bit goes a long way. And yeah, people so true. You don't have to use a lot of it. Yeah. Exactly. Um, someone's asking how to get rid of blackheads. Blackheads, it's, it's just the oil that deoxidizes. You can't really avoid it, but the only way to, the, to prevent it or to continue maintaining it is with exfoliation. So you have to exfoliate, make sure your skin is always protected with like good moisturizer and sunblock. So that way the, the, the oxidization does not happen immediately. Again, Biore is my favorite for the nose area and the, face, the rest of the face exfoliating. Salima, what is your Instagram? Salima Skin Solutions. So you got her name right? Just add Skin Solutions after it. Yeah, we got so creative. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's really good. Um, okay, yeah, people are just saying weird things now. You can continue if you have any questions. Hi, weird people. Okay, so <laughs> we're done with your treatment. How does your skin feel? It feels amazing. Look at that. Remember how you were saying earlier, my skin feels really That's dry. the problem, because so I've been suffering with dry skin, and it's the look, change at, of look at the dewiness. This is no highlight, guys. This is my skin. And it's not greasy. Exactly, and it's not greasy. It's I don't even want to touch my face, because I don't want to... And yes, guys, the enemy is your hand. Like, yeah. please do not touch your face. Exactly. My kids know me, even when they want to run to me, like, nope. Don't touch my face. <laughs> don't touch me. Go so wash true. your face, your hands, everything, and then gently. Because, you know, your hands carry a lot of the bacteria, so... Make sure you change your pillowcase often. If you wear the hijab underneath, the underneath piece needs to be clean, a new one every day, yep. especially if you suffer of acne. Mm -hmm. um, what sunblock would you recommend? <coughs> sunblock SPF 30 is the max you need. And any brand? Salima Skin Solutions. <laughs> <laughs> um, Shameless plug. That's right. <laughs> so what products do you recommend to brighten marks that have been left from spots? Brightening or retinol again the one that is prescribed by the doctor can be really really harsh on the skin and It's a skin thinner um, So you're gonna have to find something with retinol a what we have is the brightening retinol in our line and the vitamin C Those two work magic on the skin um, What's the best kit to get rid of black marks on your face? Black marks caused by what though? Okay. Um, what's good for acne scars and dry skin? dry skin always exfoliate remember people think opposite that when their skin is dry they need to over moisturize that's the opposite of what you need to do you need to exfoliate get rid of that whatever skin cells that is sitting on top that is preventing moisture from entering so once you slough it off the hydrating part just becomes that much easier and scars you need brightening right now vitamin c i think everybody should know that by heart now <laughs> i know um she said the spots the black marks from <coughs> black marks from the spots from the acne, yeah, mm. brightening right now, again. And someone said, wasn't expecting this with her eyes. Pardon? Wasn't expecting this with her eyes. The results, she wasn't expecting those results. Really? Yeah. What was she expecting? I don't know. <laughs> um, okay. Yeah, I think that's it. Okay guys, I just put Selena Skin Solution um, Instagram, I just commented it for those who couldn't find it, so you could just click it, I think. Or copy it. And, and by the way, if you go on the blog, like you go onto a website, you'll find a lot of useful information. I always say educate yourself. It's key. Don't buy into anything that worked for your friend because every skin is different. Everybody's body is different. 
make sure you do your homework and know who is treating your face because once the damage happens it's irreversible and don't go you know experimenting and getting all kinds of things just because it's cheaper those rollers like micro needling yeah guys, i've been using those guys honestly if you understood what you're doing to your skin you would honestly not do you're going to regret it so especially if you have thin skin you're going to create a lot of the broken capillaries it's damaging to the skin watch it um how much is the overall kit and how long does it last well, we have travel size kits that if you're interested in those to start with, it's 98 US dollars. All our prices is in US dollars, and that one lasts you about five weeks. Um, is there a UK supplier? You don't, we don't need a supplier. We are actually shipping directly within three days with DHL, so we do ship globally. Oh, all right, so shall we call it a wrap? Yeah. Okay guys, thank you so much for watching. If you have any more questions, remember you can DM Salima um, on her Instagram. And if you scroll up in the conversation here, you'll see I tagged it. Um, if you have any questions for me, you can leave me a DM as well. I hope you enjoy, and I'll try to do this again. Inshallah. Inshallah. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam. alaikum. I'm answering you. Okay, assalamu alaikum. It's a wrap. We're done. Noor looks beautiful. Like she has this noor to her. Look at that glow, guys. <laughs> see, it's noor, the fine at its finest now. <laughs> so, inshallah, that's, that's it for us. If you have any questions, please do let us know and we will answer them. As, as, uh, I thought you had a question. Oh, I do. Okay, how can you get rid of those little bumps under the eye? Someone asked again, the milia. The milia, yeah. the milia, sometimes you need a treatment. It's called relation. It is done in clinic because those are not something you can, especially around the eye area, so don't. But inshallah, whatever question, other questions we have next time, we will answer them. But uh, thank you for tuning in. See you next time. Assalamu alaikum.